Hello, everybody, and welcome to the June update for Well, That Didn't Work. My name's Percy. I'm Mike. And it's and already June? It's already freaking June. I thought it was July. <laughs> well, I'm not going to lie. It's been a busy week. That's the that's the, <laughs> that's the next one. Oh. That's the next All right. One. We'll wait a month for that one. Yeah, yeah. So um, I think our update is mostly about the shows we're doing now. Uh, so, Mike, take it away. What's the first update we have? So we've concluded our Urban Stars campaign. Um, we've posted our last episode, and it uh, it was a, a, a enjoyable to play. I mean, we, we loved it to death here at the table. But um, I'm glad. It's time to retire it temporarily. So uh, we do plan on revisiting that one uh, in the future and bringing some of those characters back to life. Um, I do know that as we cross over a few genres here, we are planning on making a few cameos, potentially, with a couple of players. Yeah, it would be nice. That would be kind of cool. So what do you got? So um, I want to talk about the summer show that's going to take the place. So we're not moving directly from Urban Stars into our next Star Wars game. So Star Wars is going to be just a constant staple with Well, That Didn't Work. We all love Star Wars. It's um, what brought us together. It's what brought us together. It really is. Um, we love it, but we're going to wait. And, uh, Mike, you're going to have some more details for us at the end of this update on Shh, what that means. Secret. Yes. <laughs> um, but for the summer, we're going to keep with the narrative dice. We're not going to play Star Wars, but we are going to play a game in Genesis, uh, which is Fantasy Flight's basically um, generic imagining of what the narrative dice system of Star Wars was uh, and lets you kind of make your own thing. So we're actually going to play a game... Uh, that I've called Silent and Deadly, uh, that's about spies. <laughs> I just thought about that, Percy. Yes. <laughs> uh, we will not put that comment out. <laughs> it is called Silent and Deadly, and it's about uh, basically spies like your Mission Impossible or your Kingsmen, like spies with big sure, fancy it's gadgets. About spies. Um, and hopefully not as many fart jokes as what I'm anticipating, but if there are... That's fine. <laughs> so that game's going to be tons of fun. And uh, we actually are going to start recording that here in a couple weeks. We're recording this right before the end of May um, for you guys. And in June, we're going to start recording and just pumping those episodes out as quickly as we can. So that's what we're doing after we uh, wrap up or just as we're wrapping up Call of Cthulhu. Yeah. So Call of Cthulhu is uh, going to run for the rest of the summer. Um, we plan on doing our final recording sometime in June. And uh, potentially pushing out our last episode and our wrap-up, where hopefully I make everybody go insane in uh, July. Well, we might go insane, but there's something else special happening during that episode, right? Absolutely. So during that episode in June, which will be the, or, yeah, June, yeah. right? It third, is June. Third week of June. That's why we're doing the June update. That's right. <laughs> We've been over this. Uh, my brain is mush, but thanks. Anyway, um, we will be doing our first ever Patreon giveaway. Yes. The Dice Tower that we have uh, kind of advertised over the last few months. Is, this will be, as of the time that you we put this up, update up, this will be the last opportunity to get in on that drawing. That's right. So um, subscribe to Patreon before... Uh, that third Tuesday in June, it's patreon.com slash notworkingcrew. Uh, and su subscribe to us via Patreon, and you'll have a chance to win right. a handmade wooden dice tower that Mike himself made, which is super cool. It rolls all right. 20s. Uh, and Rick has also, another cast member of ours, has also dedicated to giving away a free set of dice with the tower. Right. And uh, now with that, just keep in mind, we will all be signing the bottom yes. of this dice tower, and we'll make sure that the that it's sealed up so that you don't uh, lose that. And it will be marked as the first channel giveaway. So when we grow, you'll have boasting rights. That's right, you will. So w tell about, why don't you tell everybody else about our other staple show right now? Yeah, so Legend of the Five Rings is still going very strong. Uh, we just published recently our seventh episode, uh, The Battle of the Black Mist. I was super pumped for. I really enjoyed uh, shooting that. I thought it was a ton of fun, but it is by no means like the capstone of what L5R can do or is going to be. Um, our characters are still rank one in their schools, um, and you can go up to rank six, I think, and that's not even like the end of it. That's just like the end of school. You guys get to graduate and fight the really terrifying enemies. Uh, so Wait we are... <laughs> 
<laughs> we are nowhere near I can't survive done. really terrifying enemies. <laughs> Not yet. That's because you're rank one. Um, Ever. But uh, that game is going super strong. I'm really enjoying Legend of the Five Rings a whole ton. Uh, I think the whole table is, and we're really excited for that. But I think I'm more excited for this next one. Uh, we have our first Patreon-only show. That will start going up in June. That is a now we'll put the uh, probably the character creation and maybe episode one out for everybody to listen to uh, here in June. But right after that, it's going Patreon only. So the only people that will get this show um, are people who are subscribing at at least five dollars a month. Uh, Mike, what is what is that show? Uh, it's Alice, isn't it? It is. It's Alice. So um, for those of you that are not familiar with it, um, Alice, it's it's similar to Through the Looking Glass, but this is... Uh, it's wacky. It's twisted. So It's I'm, a dark, dark game. Mike is playing a clock master, a clock worker, a tinkerer. Yeah, we'll uh, go with that. I'll let you butcher that one. Yeah, I don't know what it's called, man. <laughs> uh, and I'm playing a dog. Uh, and we have we have two other characters in the game, and uh, Jason, who uh, you may remember as Lukia or Akrak, um, or for a short time as Shisuro Junji on L five R. Uh, he is DMing that or GMing that for us, uh, and it is a Savage Worlds Alice in Wonderland, super creepy, super weird, and we're real excited for it. So that'll start airing this month. And if I'm not mistaken, how frequently is that going to be coming out on Patreon? That's coming every week to Patreon. Right. Every single week we are going to put an episode of Alice out. Uh, and that's, I mean, it's a lot of editing, but it's worth it All for right. our Patreon subscribers. So whether you're at $2 or $15 or anywhere in between? Well, $5 is the minimum. $5 the minimum. Yeah. You have to get the bonus content sub to get the bonus content. Ah, uh, okay. Well, then I stand corrected. Yeah. Percy's our administrator for that side, so I'm um, thank you for clarifying. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> for now, sure. Now, with that, we need to talk a little bit about what's happening for year two of Well, That Didn't Work. Yes. We are quickly coming up on that point. Um, with year two, we are planning to switch most of our shows to live stream. Uh, we will continue to release through the podcast, and we will continue to release through um, YouTube. Um, however, we will constantly stream these games through uh, either Twitch or through YouTube itself. So if you would like to stick around for our live content, feel free to do so. Uh, that's pretty much going to be almost every Tuesday night uh, throughout the month. Yeah. And um, what we plan on doing is um, I am going to take over our Star Wars campaign and move us into Age of Rebellion's rule set. So that will be um, a, a, a campaign with a couple of new faces. We'll have a couple of our old and existing team, but we'll have a new fa uh, few faces in there. And then we are also going to be giving Rick a shot behind the DM chair, and he will be uh, DMing our D&D campaign. Yes, he will. I'm really excited for both of those games because... I get to play. <laughs> and it's going to go sideways. Listen, if you guys watched 7th C or listened to 7th C, you know what he's talking about. Um, I do want to make one note on the, the live <laughs> shows, though. Uh, I'm really excited about going fully live. Um, but basically what you get if you listen to us live is basically a full month's worth of content. Bam, right there. You get to listen to our full recording session where we normally do two or three episodes at a time, sometimes four. Right. So you get to be a part of that entire process. And I do want to clarify, when I talk about us being live, immediately after that show, I will be taking that content down and off of public view yes. for us to be able to edit and put out. So if you miss the live show, you have to wait for the feed. You do. You have to wait for the, the episodes to come out. So the just in closing, the last thing we want to talk about is Table Babble. Uh, we had about five or six episodes of Table Babble that came out, and they were a lot of fun for us to record, but we ran out of questions really fast. Um, because it, Are you sure you're still not the conductor of the poop train? Uh, no, I am still the conductor of the poop train. No one and nothing can take that title from me, but we need more questions. If you guys like that type of content, if you like us answering questions on the air, um, whether they're goofy questions like um, what crime would you be arrested for? Or if they're real questions like how do I make a 
a monk viable in Dungeons and Dragons? Uh, regardless of the type of question, send those things in. You can always send us a Facebook message. You can comment on any of our posts on Facebook, Twitter, or Instagram. You can email us at notworkingcrewmember at gmail.com. Um, and we'll definitely put those questions in the pool and we'll be able to do that. But, uh, we really, we need your questions to be able to make that show happen. You know what else we need? What's that? We need our viewers help in order to be able to spread the word about, well, that didn't work. We do. So you know, we have been, how can they do that? We've been, uh, climbing up in, uh, our, our, not only our subscriptions, but also our downloads over on the podcast side. And you know what? I guarantee you, if you're enjoying our stories, some of your friends, because they have similar tastes, will enjoy our stories Absolutely. as well. Just, you know, share the links over to them. Yeah, share us on uh, Facebook. Share us on Twitter. Uh, you can actually follow us on Facebook if you'd like. But um, make sure to share the content. Again, if you're enjoying it, other people will too. And you can find us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and I think even Reddit now, at, at Not Working Crew. Uh, so it's super easy to remember. You do it for all four platforms. Right. So I guess with that, it's time for us to tell you to keep on adventuring. Yeah. Sayonara. Have a good one. See you in June.